Hey Fuerte friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Trisha Fuerte and this is Fuerte Body and this is our 31st Fuerte Body break. If you don't know what Fuerte Body breaks are, you can check out Fuerte Body break 1 through 30 now on my channel. There's a whole playlist and they're a great time and in 1 through 30 I give a little bit on what Fuerte Body breaks are. So I'm so excited for you to come along for the ride and if you want to stick around for our daily affirmation please keep watching till the end um but today's for to body break is for those artists who are hesitant or for anybody who knows an artist that is hesitant to use their art and their platform to speak up i have a few quotes for you all that you can reflect on or you can send to someone to inspire them to speak up for Palestine, to speak up about injustices in our world. And they are by Toni Morrison, Nina Simone, James Baldwin, and Audre Lorde. Um, so, I mean, I mean, they're going to be really, really good quotes. Uh, please send one or all of them to someone today okay i didn't memorize them i should i should i feel like they should be mantras you know but the first one is this is precisely the time when artists go to work there is no time for despair no place for self-pity no need for silence no room for fear we speak we write we do language this is how civilizations heal and that is tony morrison I, I don't need to say any more. That says everything. Go, go now. Go send that quote to someone. Go use it. Go start. It's never too late to start. If you feel like, oh my gosh, like I haven't said anything, but so why should I say anything now? Are people going to judge me if I'm, if I'm only starting to speak up now? No, it's never too late. It's never too late to start speaking up. Please do. Our next quote. Ah, uh, this is, I did, I posted this on my TikTok and YouTube shorts, and this is my lock screen right now. Once you start to speak, people will yell at you. They will interrupt you, put you down, and suggest it's personal, and the world won't end, and the speaking will get easier and easier, and you will find you have fallen in love with your own vision, which you might never have realized you had, and you will lose some friends and lovers and realize you don't miss them. Oh, I'm... I'm sorry to interrupt the quote, but I'm really feeling that right now. I really don't miss the people in my life who are not speaking up right now. The quote continues, and new ones will find you and cherish you. That is true. And you will still flirt and paint your nails, dress up and party, because as I think Emma Goldman said, if I can't dance, I don't want to be part of your revolution. And at last, you'll know with surpassing certainty that only one thing is more frightening than speaking your truth, and that is not speaking. I feel like this one, this is my favorite, Audre Lorde. Um, I feel like this one, it, it applies to everyone. It not, it's not just artist-specific. Um, educators, social workers... Uh, look, I'm wearing my social work in it sweatshirt. Um, but everyone, hum just if you are a human with empathy, um, and you're hesitant right now, and you, it's not enough. Oh my gosh, who said it? It's not. I think they said it at a protest. Um, it's not enough. It may have been Fatima from within our lifetime, the organization. Um, it's not enough to just know what is happening in Palestine is bad. It's not enough. Um, do something, say something. I, I just love that one so much. Um, please send that one to someone or have it as your lock screen also. 
This next one, um, Nina Simone, how can you be an artist and not reflect the times? Yeah, I feel like this one, I, it's just, it's a question that we should always ask ourselves as artists. Um, and I feel like it's a question that goes along with, you know, an artist will always ask them we always ask ourselves like who is this for uh, or why are we doing this uh, and this is another one that I feel like should be part of that same um, reflection you should ask yourself why why our art shouldn't reflect the times so that's why I question um, artists who are you know promoting makeup lines and shapewear and things like that um I've, I've said it a few times now and I feel like this is an ongoing reflection that I'll have on Fuerte Body Breaks of like just really seeing right now um who are artists who are celebrities, who are business people. Um, and I'm not quite sure yet if, um, you know, if I could consider people who are celebrities, if, if celebrities can still be artists, maybe at some point in their lives, I could, I could say there are a few people who, I don't consider artists anymore um, may have lost lost themselves in it all uh, but they were once true artists at a point in time but you let me know I've suddenly started um, I've started seeing more content asking the question of of my last four to body break on if we can compartmentalize and separate art from artists and I, I'm seeing a lot of people say that, of course, we can make the objective judgment like this, this photograph looks good, this outfit looks good, um, this song has a catchy beat, this music video was visually stunning, but um, like, yeah, at the, at the end of the day, art is an individual experience. Um, for each of us and so you know we make that personal choice um when it comes down to it do we like it or not because of you know our relationship I just <laughs> saw challengers on uh, the way she explained the way Zendaya's character explained tennis as a relationship uh that's really staying with me so yeah our relationship to the artwork uh, will never be the same as anybody else, of course. I um, think we know that, but felt good to say that out loud. Good to re remind us. <laughs> the last quote that I have is James Baldwin. The precise role of the artist, then, is to illuminate the darkness, blaze roads through the vast forest, so that we will not in all our doing, lose sight of its purpose, which is, after all, to make the world a more human dwelling place. And the world, gosh, that, those last three words, human dwelling place. Yeah, I just, that, I'm so glad we're ending on that one because the world right now truly is not a human dwelling place. And I celebrated my two years of dance uh, this week and I, I had dance yesterday and I filmed myself for the first time. It's my most recent short. Um, or by the time you see this, two shorts ago, because um, I have another one scheduled. But um, gosh, when I am dancing, that 
it's so and being a vessel to the instructors instructors choreography um truly the the world feels more human dwelling and I even if you you watch this particular piece that I danced um in contemporary class it human dwelling is truly a way to describe the movement it's very fluid very daydreamy very free um and I haven't felt that way in a really long time and so I'm really grateful to Mac my instructor at PMT here in New York City and then also the song is called Honey by Ravina a uh, beautiful beautiful song um that really connected me back to my body um and that's what it's about that feeling that human dwelling feeling more of that okay let's do our daily affirmation if those <laughs> quotes were not affirmation enough um oh this one popped out immediately it's okay to redefine what a successful life looks like for me. And that is from Femis Lay on Instagram. Um, that's a really nice one to hear after my performance review. My performance review went went good. Uh, but it's just, it's nice to hear an aff- and say an affirmation like that um, after, you know, having to reflect on your like performance (laughs) under under capitalism um and let's drink our water cheers go get your water don't forget to drink your water did you drink it did you drink your water don't forget to drink your water and don't forget to wash your water bottle frequently um Thanks. Thanks so much for listening to those quotes with me, reflecting on those. Uh, And if you share it with someone, share any of those with anyone. Thank you so much. Um, Thank you so much with all of my love. Always and always. I'm Trisha Fuerte and this is Fuerte Body.